was you But you threw it back at me You made me a fool And then you sent me away You make me cry, you make me cry I thought we had the good days Or was it all okay? How did it go, babe? So, do you think you guys got the contract? Uh, well, we, we did our best, but um, nothing is certain. So, when are they going to get back to you? About, well, a week, two weeks, maybe more. I really pray you get the contract. Amen. Thank you. Babe, you're so brilliant and you've worked so hard. No. Yeah. Um, babe, I'll have to call you back. I just got back, so I need to freshen up and you know, rest. Okay. I love you. Yeah. So much. I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. Mm. Love that fun. Yeah, she gave me butterflies in my belly. Oh, no. Uh -uh. no, this girl, what did it worry you? What did Leo say to you now? Well, he told me that he loves me. Is that why you're dancing up and down like this? What's that now? <clears throat> well, I'm not surprised. I know that anything concerning love is alien to you. What do you mean, excuse me? When was the last time you were in a relationship, madam? Um, it's none of your business. Exactly! Yes! Wait, 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 wait. So, for your full mind now, this I don't know anything about love, eh? No. I am just saying that you have refused to move on. You know what? I'm not in the mood for all of that. What do you mean by stop, stop, stop? You're not in the mood for what? Okay, I'm in the mood. Oh, by the way, Leo's friend is single, just in case. If you change him, and he's cute too. And when he tells me my love is your love, baby, me no want the Gucci bag or the Bentley. Why do you shake it like lizard? What do you? Don't start the deceive person daughter again. So do you just drop the phone like said it's in the boy in your hand? I don't want. All this love, love talk we have to get it do right now. Look at what I mean, Love talk. From you, where they chase girl, where you know, you know her name up and down. Girl! <laughs> See that girl? She's hot. Damn, she's sexy, man. Don't worry. We ain't scored. <laughs> so how you want to take Duan now? I don't think do it, then. That big girl is obviously in love with you. And you now, you don't decide, say, now this girl matter you could die put. I want to take wrong both of them. <laughs> it makes you think say I won't run both of them. But at this time and age, who get power to the wrong two women? Nah. Look, I have nothing against that big girl, but um, right now, what I need is excitement in my life and uh Abby girl doesn't offer that. So you want to break up with her? Mm, eventually. Eventually, but that's after I've secured my new chick. Until then, Abigail is good enough. The mad. Oh, she's good enough now just because she loves you. Look, I don't know where they carry this stock. They go, make her go find food, job. This thing look good, though. No, be Abigail, though. And, guy, I beg him, when you want to break up with Abigail, make sure I know the house, though. Why now? You know now. I don't get strength to come the console person, they wipe tears. Oh. Are you savvy? I don't talk my own. <laughs> Guy, you know, I didn't believe when you said she was going to be here, right? No? You thought I was joking, right? <laughs> yeah. Ah. <laughs> but how did you know? I think when I want something. I don't mind going out of my way. You know now. You know. 
<laughs> well, how do you even create time for this your detective work? Oh, I want what I want. You know me. I want what I want. And by the way, we are registering here, okay? Yes, this is where we're going to be every Saturday. Guy, it's in the guy. Do you not see the distance we drove to this place? Now you drive. Ah, right, let's go, Joe. Hello? So, yeah. Hello? Good morning. <laughs> Why are you going to look in this gorgeous? Leo's this. This early? Mm -hmm. I was go making breakfast. <laughs> well, don't ma. Something is <laughs> definitely wrong with you. <laughs> but seriously, I admire how much you love him, though. That's because he's everything. I know. But would you like to come with me, though? So you can try to hook me up with Johnson. No, thank you. You might like him. I will not. Fine. I'm on my way then. Have fun. I sure will. And I'm going to tell you you said hi. I didn't send you. You did. Are you sabby? Crazy ass girl. You're not okay. And that's how it is. I, I had to just abandon him. Complete you talk. <laughs> Hi, Johnson. Well, you, you're here. Yes, and I made breakfast. I miss you. I miss you too. Yeah. Why are you staring at me like that? Because um, you are beautiful. You are so handsome. <laughs> and I love you. I love you too. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, I have to freshen up now. Okay. I'll get breakfast for you, okay? Right. Hey! Um, guess what? What? I think I'm going to get pregnant for you. That's madness talking. Well, I knew you wouldn't agree, but hear me out, okay? There's no reason good enough to encourage that. Uh -uh. But they just listen to me first now. Listen, mm -hmm. I spent the whole day with him and I feel strongly in my guts that we are going to end up together. <laughs> then wait for him to make that move. Then, is it ever possible for you to just hear about a relationship and not think that it will go bad. And is it possible for you to stop acting so naive and wait till you get married to him before getting pregnant? Well, but I hope you know that the society has gone beyond this philosophy of marry and have kids. And in that same world that we live in, we see how single mothers suffer. Fine. I just wanted your opinion. See, Abigail, don't act on this. Listen, I know you love you. But just allow things happen the right way, for your own good. Ha! I've heard you. Maybe I've heard you. You're welcome. Is this one even okay? <laughs> This guy should calm down now. Hello, Barry. Calm down. We're on our way. We're like 25 minutes out. Guy, calm down now. I said calm down. You will see us in like a bit. Before you know it, you will see us. Yeah. Okay, cool. Bye. What did he say? That we're already like 25 minutes late. You know him now. This guy would have probably got in there like 40 minutes ago and he would now make sure that Oga sees him. Why are we even following this guy to this pitch? Why? Because he was the one that got the job. Can't stand him. Yeah, but I can't. Hey, what's up? Ah, what's happened? Dude. Maybe that girl be that. Yeah. Wow. 
No way. She's probably walking. Mm, so this is where she walks. What? What's in the worry? You guys are already like late. What's this now? Relax now, just five minutes. Let me have a watch. She's no, no, she's no, going. No, no, guy, no. Let's go, let's go. We don't have that kind of time. Look, you already know where she works, so you know where you can meet her outside the gym. That was for you. So guy, five, five minutes go kill you. Guy, we did this. Now my phone that they call. No we'll go. No we'll go. Guy, go now. Now, now my go. phone in the call. No worry. This is the way you do. No worry. I go remind you. Hey, baby. Hey, you. I'm okay. And you? I'm really tired. Oh, must have been a hectic day. Yes, it was. Uh, well, I'm going to have to call you back. Huh? Oh, okay. Love. Love you. What? Everything okay? Because I've been standing here long enough to see you go from happy to this look I'm looking at right now. What did he say? Nothing. He said he'll call me back. Is that where you're from? Babe, what's with the questions now? For crying out loud, you just thought I was trying to talk to my man. And he said he cannot talk to me now, so fine. I will wait until he has the time to talk to me. Is that okay? Fine! No, I saw the signs. What? I'm trying to do some investments. I need you to guide me. How much are you paying? <laughs> you name your price. I mean, you're the best financial advisor ever. So yes, it's been worth it. <laughs> See what? <laughs> oh, you have to move you now. I will. I'll look. Okay, you just go change while I mesmerize you with some coconut rice. Are you for real? <laughs> then, sweetheart, you will be getting my expertise for free. <laughs> All right, I'll would change you like it. Thank All right. you. Hello. Hi. Don't I know you? Of course you do. We work out in the same gym. Oh, yes. How is it going? Great. I see you work here. Yes, I do. Um, sorry to bug you, but um, I was hoping I could take you out to lunch. Oh, wow. You really know how to go straight to the point. But I don't think I can make it today. Do you have a complimentary card? Of course I do. All right. There you go. All right. Oh. Give you a call and a time. Okay. Uh, um, how about I drop you off? Oh, don't worry. I'm parked just across the street. Okay, great. All right, see ya. Bye. So, are you going to work on that? Are you going to have dinner with me? <laughs> I am in a relationship. You've said that more than a zillion times. I just want dinner. <laughs> so, what do you want to tell me over dinner? That I'm the most beautiful girl you've ever seen. Come on, you've said that a million times already, okay? How do you know what I'm going to talk about? What, what? if I decide to talk about how smart you are? <laughs> You're a clown. <laughs> Johnson. Hi, Abigail. Great Hi. to see you. Same here. Um, is Leo back? Uh, no, he's not. Oh, I've been calling him. He's not been picking my calls. Yeah, I don't know anything about that. Okay. Uh, Johnson. Yes. Are you in a relationship? What? 
Anyways, I know you're not in a relationship. I'm just asking you that for formality's sake. Look, I want you to meet my girlfriend, Susie. I am super sure you will like her. But she's been running away from relationships. She's not the only one. So you've been running too? Yeah, I like to take my time. Look, I think you should meet her. You never can tell. You guys could hit it off. Why do you feel the need to find her in one? Well, let's just say I like the way Leo makes me feel. And I would really love her to feel that way too. So? Okay, um, I will think about it. Good! I will wait. And here, this is yours. Thank you. You're welcome. I'll just sit and keep calling. My baby. Okay. I'll right. be inside. Okay. Materials are very expensive now. What's it happen? Why do you think I'm talking to you on a normal call and not on that WhatsApp group? Please hold on. Babe, are you okay? Your face! See, she's your friend. Talk to her. Let her reduce the money. Ah, uh -uh, what's it happen? We don't have to break the bank because of our shipping now. All I loved was you. Mm. Well, for no. How did it go? It was a no show. What? She didn't show up. Wait. You mean she sent you an address, then refused to show up? Plus, she didn't take or return calls. Okay. This girl is obviously playing with your heart. Nah, come on. See, nah, babe. It is respect. I know much of her, she will still left. That means you're not walking away. Walking away? How? Guy, yeah, you forget who you talk to. I'm a hunter. If she like, make she go up. Then go down, duck, do anything. Anyhow. Okay. 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 I need to collect that key from that girl. Can you imagine? Like these calls are driving me crazy. This guy, she brought this food I'm eating. She made sure she brought it here before going home. That girl is always trying to make sure you're okay. So? Wait, what did this girl do you? Because I don't understand your reaction these days. Is there something she did that I missed? My reaction, the reaction of a man who is tired, okay? I am tired. Can you see? Can you see? Guys, she's calling you because you refuse to pick even one, not even one of her calls. Pick it now. 
Tell me something. You like Abigail? You think they worry? No, because I don't understand how you take the defender. It's something there in your mind where you want to tell me. Tell me. Yeah, if you want to talk, just the talk. Say anything you like. Wait till I know they say. Treat this girl well. She's trying. She never do you anything. Treat her well. Me God no go punish you. Now you God go punish. And no fear. That food remain, have you? Oh, you even they talk for the food. You don't think that she buy this food where the wrong king go kitchen go chop so uh -huh. next thing no go chop you kill. He go kill you, foolish man. They go chop. here so early well i was worried about you why because you've not been picking your calls and you've not returned them either but um i've been very busy okay i've been very busy in work hi abigail hi johnson well that's why i came to make sure that you're okay i'm fine um plus this is going to continue for a while because i've, I've I've really gotten busy at work. So many things I have to attend to now. But are we okay? Like, is everything fine with us? Oh, why would you ask a thing like that? Because it just feels distance. No, babe. It's just work. I'm just um, saddled with a lot right now. Hmm? But uh, we need to get going to work, okay? I also need to get prepped. Okay. I love you. Babe, I said I love you. Same Okay. You don't need me to help you. No, no, it's fine. Alright. Bye. Bye. I'll call you. Love you. Oh, it's kind of busy. You did busy for Oh, God, come off on my face. I tell be your Bloody business. Liar. Guy, I don't tell you if you want her. Take her. I don't ask you before. I don't want. No worry. Keep her. Don't go talk now. The next time, just remove your your mouth from matter. We no concern you. It's in concern myself now. Even me, the fuck up. Me, I just did ready for. Hi. Hi. I'm so sorry for the other day. Okay? No, you're not. Why would you say that? Because you could have returned my calls, but you were intentional about not returning them. Uh, how sure are you? Like I said, you could have returned my calls, you know, send an SMS, but... And I didn't. You didn't. So what are you doing here? You should be pissed. I guess deep down, I still want my lunch or dinner. I like the fact that you are so persistent, so lunch it is. But I hope it's for real this time. For real. Okay. I'll wait for your call. Sure, you'll get it. Can I walk you? That's fine. <laughs> Can you make what happened? Put you through it back. Huh? Nothing. What do you mean nothing? It's nothing really. So you came back the other day frowning. I let that slide. And now this. What exactly is going on? I don't know, but I just feel like something is off between Leo and I. 
Like he just feels distant. Did did he say anything? Not really. I called him all through the day and he didn't pick my calls or return them. Um, maybe he was busy. Well, he said that. And then he also said that it might get a little worse because of work. Well, if you ask me, I feel like he needs to assure you that even if he's busy, he will make out time for you. Exactly. I didn't hear or feel any form of assurance from him. Let's not read meaning into it yet, okay? Yeah, you're right. Um, what was it you wanted to show? Aha, yeah, so some of my friends want your advice on some investment. And they are ready to pay. Hey, no, they shouldn't because by extension, they're my friends too. So I can't charge them. I knew you were going to say that. You beautiful girl with the big heart. Come here. Thank you. Ah. Hey. What happened now? You just left like that. Yeah. I know, say, you go go by your girl office now. So I. I don't get strength for an hour, I beg you. <laughs> I went to see her, uh, Mel. Guess what? Lunch or dinner will be happening soon. <laughs> oh, that's nice. Mm hmm. Guy, I want to tell you something. I'm listening. Break up with Abigail. Break up with her before you start something with this your new girlfriend. At least just give her that respect. Why are you so concerned about Abigail and I? How am I concerned? You haven't noticed that for a while now, our conversation has always been about Abigail and I. <laughs> for two years, I have watched her love you. She has taken care of us just because of you, guy. Think I'm now. And she has been the only one who has invested in this relationship, right? I haven't. I'm just saying, you should do the right thing. You both know you're no longer interested in her. Just let her go. Tell her. Yeah. I won't do such, okay? I won't do that until I am sure of where I stand with Scarlett. So you're going to keep the two women? Yeah, that's very selfish. Very selfish. No, I'll just um, take all this your talks in a plea. So. <clears throat> because it is really not your business. And um, you need to decide where your loyalty lies, okay? Whether now we have be girl or me, because it'd be like saying you won't begin to sleep outside. <laughs> <With the Chris. laughs> but you're right though, it's none of my business, so you can enjoy yourself. <laughs> the idea of financial freedom as soon as possible woke me up. <laughs> Honestly, <sighs> I'm still waiting. Me, I'm tired though. I'll leave here anytime soon. I'm tired of waiting. How did I know? <laughs> I, th I thought I told you. My girlfriend is a financial advisor. She works with one consultancy firm. She literally handled every... Um, can I, can I call you back, please? Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. I like the place? Yeah, it's not bad. Good. Excuse me. I would like um, one of your finest mocktails. 
Oh no. What would you? I think I'll have the same. Go ahead. Thank you. So, why today? I just don't want you to lose your job because you resume at my office. <laughs> that is quite thoughtful of you. And I hope you stop the fake workouts at the gym. Excuse you? Oh, please. You think I don't notice your eyes all over me when it comes to the gym? I, um, I hope that didn't spook you in any way. No. It doesn't. <laughs> what? <laughs> You're beautiful. Thank you. You don't look bad yourself. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, tell me about your girlfriend so we get it out of the way. <laughs> what makes you think I have one? Yeah. Tell know. me about your boyfriend. What makes you think I have one? Oh, wow. So that's how we're going to play this. You are calling the shots here. <laughs> okay. Um, we broke up. Why? We drifted apart. Is she out of the country? No. So what happened there? I just gave you an answer. That is all I could, you know, come up with. You seem really prepared for my questions. No, no, I'm just being honest. I mean, I'm single. It turns out that you're single. I would like to be friends. So there is no need to lie about anything. Okay. I can be truthful too. I just got out of a long relationship and I don't think I'm ready to get into a new one. That's fine. I appreciate the honesty. Plus, I like to take things one step at a time. So no pressure. I appreciate that. Great. So, well, the food here really great. So, I will let you do the honors. No, you good. do that. You brought me here. No, you're the lady. Go ahead. Okay. Just say so. <laughs> that is not even all. The moment you sign up with us, we'll continue to check on your company on a regular basis. Yes. <laughs> Well, that is to evaluate your financial situation and keep fine-tuning your future goals and plans accordingly. <laughs> yes, that is all on the bonus packing. <laughs> well, I am representing my company the same way you are, sir. <laughs> yes, I do have a boss I report to. Okay. I'll be waiting for your response, a positive one. Thank you, good night. Hey. Hey, are you okay? How? I don't know, you look sad. <clears throat> yeah, I'm okay. But then I was just, I was just thinking, Thinking about what? How life goes on even when we lose those that we love. What happened again? Anyways, it's nothing. Don't I have the right to be emotional from time to time? Oh, you do have the right to be emotional, sweetheart. But are you okay, Dora? I'm fine. Why? Okay, of course you are. Yeah. Nothing strange. I'm fine. Okay, carry on.
Mm. Ouch! Yeah, hello, babe. How far? I didn't say you're around now. I'm just leaving your room. Um, I'm at Leo's. What's going on there? Well, I closed from work early, so I just stopped by the market to. Are you cooking there? <laughs> yes, as you know, I do that from time to time. Not really, but I just thought cooking would at least ease up the tension. Man, I don't know, like, is there a problem? How? We have been kicking against this cooking thing now. I'm just looking out for you. No, no, no. Oh, no, no. Like, no, no. Wait, wait, I need to go. I think Leo is I here. And I wanted to have finished cooking. Time and time again. Do not have a girlfriend. How many times do you want me to say it? Left to me, you would have moved in with me, but you're the one stalling. All right, I'll talk to you when I'm settled in. Bye, beautiful. <laughs> you know, he doesn't. What now? Why did you do like pants like this, man? What? Abigail, you want me to break up with her? Fine, I will. As soon as this girl just, you know, confirm things. And the way the ministry they move now. Hey, hey, she don't need dance to the tune. Hey, hey. She don't need dance to the tune. Guy, now you know. Guy, which one be now me know? Behave yourself. Be sharp guy now. Hey, hey. It's kind dead thing you did, you like this. Abigail. Um, hi. Hi, did you, you... You just came in, right? Yes. Great. Um, you're taking that into the kitchen, right? Because I was just going in to get a glass of water. Um, yes. Hello, Scarlett. It's nice to finally meet you. We've been talking on the phone. Yes, the pleasure is all mine. Thank Do you. have a seat. Thank you. This is my colleague, Dave. Hi, Dave. Hi. Um, I'm so sorry, but I would have to wait for my boss to join us. He says he would like to sit in. Oh, sure, that's fine. We'll wait. All right, thank you. Yes. Um, excuse me, please. Okay. Hello. I'm doing good. How about you? I'm actually at a meeting, okay, and I'm waiting for my boss to get here. Leo, I beg, leave me alone. You're saying all these nice things because you want me to go out to dinner with you again, right? Anyways, how is your friend? Yes, Johnson. How is he? 
All right, just tell him I said hi and everything. Yeah, okay. I mean, I'm still waiting for my boss, so I'll talk to you soon. All I loved was you. But you threw it back at me. You made me a fool. Abigail. Abigail, open up. Abigail, are you okay? Open, I'm coming in now. What happened? What happened? Huh? Abigail. The other day when I went over to his place to cook for him, I overheard him talking about ending things with me once his new relationship starts. I was having a meeting with a client today only for me to find out that it's the same girl Leo was referring to. How do, how do you know this? Because while we were waiting for her boss, Leo called. Could have been any Leo. It is not any Leo. This same Leo has a friend called Johnson. Well, in that case, I guess my suspicions has been confirmed. What suspicion? I was at a restaurant the other day and I I saw Leo walking with a lady. Seems like they have something together. You didn't tell me. I was not sure of anything. I mean, she could have been anyone. I'm so sorry. It's okay. It's okay. Look. I walked out of that meeting and now I'm not even sure what Dave said or didn't say. I'm just... I don't even know. God. What, are you, what are you going to do now? I don't know. <laughs> just feel... dumb and stupid. Like... It's okay, it's okay. Don't be hard on yourself, okay? Just just calm down. Should I at least get you something to eat? I thought you loved me. Like I really Hey fine girl. <laughs> hey Star Boy, you know what you're doing. You know, you know what you're doing. All right, no problem. Um, I'll let you eat, okay, and just call me back. All right. But wait, I could have sworn I saw shopping bags in the kitchen the other day. Um, Abigail came around, and she was planning to cook. Petro, are you talking to me? Hello, do. Who had you talked to before? What's it happen? She she pack everything go near and she no cook again. Let me call her. No. So why are we having this conversation? No oh, for you. But wait, eh, no be food way they buy for that nonsense area around right? this. That food way no they ever agree sweet. Guy, calm down. Your body to the hot. Just even go to the cash. Whatever. Because you go buy food with the single chop once. You know. Why are you not taking a call? It's my boss. I guess he has spoken to Dave. Why didn't you speak to him today at the office? I didn't go to the office. What? I, 
I couldn't bring myself to dress up. But I will not do that again. Hello, sir. Oh, I'm, I'm, I feel better now, sir. It's just a few hours. Yes, I'll be coming into the office tomorrow. I'm still following up on the client. I plan on meeting her tomorrow. Okay, sir. Thank you so much. Bye, sir. She doesn't sound angry. Apparently, Dave told him I'm not feeling too well. <laughs> thank God, though. So, what are you going to do now? Focus on my work and help him get rid of me faster. Happy girl. Don't make any decisions now that you're pissed. What decision? Leo has already made the decision for both of us. I actually thought I was in a relationship all this while with a man that loves me and cares about me. I didn't know he was tired of me and already looking for a way to get rid of me. How was I this stupid? <laughs> Look, I don't even know what to say or do, but forgive me if I intend to make it faster for him. What are you going to do? I don't know. I don't know. Oh my god, I have a headache. Oof. Oof. Hello? Hello, good morning. Hi, good morning. Dave told me you had to leave because you were not feeling so well. Um, y yes, I had to. I was standing next to you and you couldn't even tell me. Even if my back was turned to you, you could have at least informed me so we rescheduled. Um, I'm, I'm sorry, I just felt comfortable since I knew Dave could actually handle the meeting. And besides, you were on a call and I didn't want to disturb you. I was talking to a friend, it was nothing official. And my boss was really hoping to listen to you. I'm sorry about that. Um, please, can we reschedule? My boss is not in town at the moment. Okay, can I at least meet with you first, then I'll wait for your boss to return? Um, I'm, I'm not sure I'm going to make it to the office today. Um, I'm on my way to a meeting and I'll be going home right after. Unless you want us to meet at a restaurant close to my place. Oh, that's, that's okay. That's fine. Just um, send me the address and I'll be there. Okay, that's fine. See you then. Okay, thank you. supposed to be here. Um, who? Your boyfriend. But I'm not here to see my boyfriend. S so then why are you crying? Nothing. Thank you. Oh. 
why is that funny? I have five sisters. And you're like the third one. She pretends that nothing is wrong when there's something wrong in trouble. Well, mister, I am not your sister. And I am here for a business meeting, okay? Business meeting? Then you should clean your face some more. Maybe apply some powder and look as professional as you should be. Thank you. Can you please leave now? I'm Felix. Well, that is not the response I was expecting. It's all right. Excuse me. Hi, I'm, I'm so sorry. Oh, hi. I've been waiting. It's okay. Please have a seat. Thank you so much. Would you like anything? No, I'm fine. Thank you. Okay, so I'll just get right to it then. Uh, sorry, I'm sorry about this. Oh, okay, it's fine. Oh my God. Another meeting? No, exactly. Um, so it's my boyfriend. I mean, sorry, my potential boyfriend. But I'll just send him a message, okay? Don't worry about that. Well, why is he your potential boyfriend? Because I'm trying to figure out if it's for real, for real. Oh. But. It, you know, it's, it's difficult to tell if it's for real if you're not actually in the relationship. Because even though you're in the relationship, you still may not be able to tell. Yeah, but you can't rush into one. Of course not. My opinion? Go ahead. I feel like if you're sure the person is single and you're comfortable around this person, then that should be enough to lead you into the first step of saying yes. Okay. Then how he treats you in the relationship will determine if you leave or stay. Oh, did my mother send you though? <laughs> You know what? Send me your package, yeah? I'm recommending you guys. Really? Of course. Thank you so much. But, but, retaining us is totally on you. We will not disappoint you. As a matter of fact, my company's priority is to make sure our clients make the best financial decisions. Okay. Thank you so much. Let me go say yes, but... I'll be expecting your email. All okay. right. Okay. All right. Thank Bye. you. Bye. All I loved was you. What did I just do? But you threw it back at me. Mm -hmm. Wow. You, you did beautifully well. Fool. You know what? Uh, here's my company card. Please. Give me a call. My company might need your services. Thank you. You make me cry, you make me cry. I thought we had the good what days. Have I told you? Or was it all a game? You break my heart, you break my heart. Was my love? Guy, 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 Scarlet is coming. What? Scarlet is coming! How did you manage to convince her? Dude, I don't know what I said or what I did, but I have to keep that up. But the point is, Scarlet is coming! Which one be home again? Okay, what to break up with Abigail, right? Done. Okay, it's done. Hey. Hey. 
name? Hi, Miss Beautiful. Hello, Mr. Hassan. Yes. What? Yes, and don't make me... Wait, yes to us? Yes. You have no idea how happy this makes me. Babe, what's wrong? Huh? What's going on? I... I just helped... I helped you get the girl that he wanted. How do you mean? I... I had a meeting with her today. And... I don't it's know. Okay. I don't know why I did it. I I I just I just I just it's okay. make me cry. You make me cry. <laughs> the time we had in the good days. Was it all a okay? game? You break my heart. You break my heart. Excuse me, sir. You've been sitting here for a while now. Please, can I know who you are looking for? Oh, don't worry. She'll soon be here. Oh, really? Sorry, sir. Please, I would like to know the name so I can call the person for you. Don't worry. She'll soon be here. Oh. Hi, Abigail. What do you think you are doing coming to my office? Hey, there's no need to use that tone with me. Well, I do not appreciate you doing this. Doing what exactly? Coming here looking for me. I am not interested. I see, I am not looking for you in the way you're thinking. I'm married and I have sisters. And I am not your sister. Okay. I wanted to make sure you're okay. Well, I'm fine as you can see. Thank you. Abigail. Come on. Look, I'm trying so hard to be interested in single men. Talk more of a married man like you. Don't be interested in me. All right? I'm married. My wife is everything and more. So what do you want? You know, I, I watched you speak with the lady at the restaurant the other day. You know, you tried so hard to convince her from the beginning. And then suddenly an opportunity showed up, and you took hold of it. What opportunity? You got to her emotionally, trying to convince her to say yes to the guy she was considering. But needed a little bit of encouragement to do that. And pam, you got what you wanted. I can assure you, you do not know what you're talking about. Oh, I was dear. So what do you want? Come work for me. Yeah, I, I'll pay you three times whatever you paid here. <laughs> for how long, if I may ask? Two or three months before your company falls off? Oh, <laughs> that's because you don't know my company. Okay, I'll begin with this. I'll pay you six months advance. Why on earth would you want to do that? Because I can afford to do so. See, you were spectacular. Well, I did nothing special, okay? You may not realize it, but I was right there. You were dealing with something that was so personal to you. And then the moment the lady walked in, you put up such a good attitude to represent your company. I need that. Well, I am not leaving my company, okay? 
I am not interested. Okay, how about freelancing until I'm able to find someone else? You know, I, I really need... Look, there are a thousand and one people out there that you can hire. Look, I watched you. And if I was your boss, I'll give you a promotion right there. Look, I've been waiting here for almost an hour. Promise me you think about it. Fine. I will think about it. And I will call you when I make a decision. Right now, I have to get into my meeting. Thank you. Please, don't, don't forget to think about it, please. Oh, okay, no problems. All right, bye. Hey, girl. Hi. Ah, why is your face like this? My boss wants to have lunch with me tomorrow. I'm so scared. Lunch? Uh, uh, are you sure he's not trying to hit on you? My boss is not like that. As a matter of fact, he's been reshuffling and laying off staff, especially in the finance department. So scared I'll be next. You, next. Girl, have you seen how hard you've been working lately? You're not going anywhere, okay? You'll be fine. Well, I'm still scared regardless. Anyways, how was your day? My day? Hmm. Well, aside dealing with one guy that wants to snatch me from my company, my day was good. Was his offer good? Does it matter? Babe, I'm not going anywhere. My company is treating me well. Besides, his offer is ridiculous. How can somebody say he wants to pay me three times my salary and he will pay me six months in advance? <laughs> what? My point exactly. Does he even know how much you earn? Maybe that's just a speak-up line. Which speak-up line? The guy said he's married with kids. Besides, nothing will ever happen between us. Uh, of course. You are. Please, can you meet me at lunch tomorrow so we can meet my friends concerning that investment plan? On the condition that you make me your signature coconut rice? <laughs> just pray I don't get fired. If I don't get fired, definitely. I would spoil you. you know? Firstly, you are not getting fired. Secondly, no coconut rice, no meeting. I'll hold on to that. Please pray for me. I want so I can give you the coconut rice. <laughs> I just hope I don't get fired. God help me. Whew. Um. Oh, babe. How did it go? Girl, it's a promotion. Are you serious? Congratulations! Thank you. He's selling the bills. Let's just say hi to him before we go. Oh, okay, good. Okay. So, are you now going to be heading like a department or what? I will be heading a new unit. 30% salary increase. I just... And then oh, oh my god, come here! Wow! No. What is he doing here? Oh, that's my boss. Let's just say hi to him before we leave. Huh? Mr. Felix, my best friend in fact. Really? Yeah. How come your friend is my friend too? Uh, Abigail, I'm still waiting for your call. All right? Susie? Yes, sir. Okay, uh, I'll, I'll see you at the office. Yeah, okay, sir. What was that about? It's nothing. Let's just go, okay? Let's go. Okay, let's just go. Okay. Uh, babe, how, how do you know my boss? Well, he's the one that offered me a job. The married guy with children? Yes. <laughs> he's not married. As a matter of fact, his father has been on his neck to get married for years. <laughs> so why then did he say he was married? He even said his wife is everything to him. Maybe he likes you. And, and he's a funny guy, so you probably was just joking. <laughs> How does someone joke with a thing like that? Like... Anyways, thank God I'm not even interested. See, girl, he can pay you whatever amount he mentioned. That guy is well deep. He oversees the finance department, so his offer is valid. And he uses a recruiting company, but then he came to you. <laughs> That's a simple... Felix likes... Happy girl! <laughs> I don't want anybody liking me right now. Uh, see, there is Dave on this hand. 
and there is my boss on the other. So who is it going to be? None. <clears throat> that is pain talking. But don't worry, you'll be fine. Well, I will. Oh my god. Yeah, who is that? I'm coming. <clears throat> Hi, Leo. Hi. Please come in. Yeah, yeah. she is. Just sit, I'll go get her. All right. Thank you. I'll be back. Hey. Hi. Hi. You left the house the other day and um, I haven't seen or heard from you since. Well, you didn't call either. Well, none of that really matters now because I I came to talk about uh, the obvious state of our situation. Which is? What we have is no longer working. Have we gone? Says who? Let's be real. When was the last time you came over? When was the last time you called? But I believe we've both been busy. Oh, well. Don't make this hard for me. Make what's hard for you? I'm done. I'm leaving you. Why are you leaving me? Are you dating someone else? Do I have to be dating someone else to want to break up? Well, I'm just asking. Well, no, I am not. But we both should be open to, you know, dating other people. Well, you seem eager. Are you seeing someone else that you like more than me? There you go. Um, for what it's worth, we can remain friends. Do you really mean that? Would you prefer we become enemies? Well. I'm surprised being that you are so eager to break us up. Ah, you know what, um, at this point I think I've done um, what's civil. So, whatever you want it to be, it's fine. Do take care. Ah, everything okay? to hurt this much. That was a guy you loved so much. It's understandable. I, I'm so sorry. You know what? This is the last time I will cry about this. I'll be fine. You make me cry, you make me cry. <laughs> So we had uh, the babe. You break my heart, you break my heart. So Margaret, I will need you to reschedule the meeting between us and our prospective partners, okay? Okay. You saw the mail that the MD sent. He won't be able to make it for the meeting, right? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so I need you to reschedule that meeting, okay? Okay, ma'am. All right. So Ooh, hi. Abigail. Hey. 
How are you doing? Okay, sorry. I have not received any call from you yet, so oh, should I give you my card again? Well, that is because I do not want anything to do with you or your job offer, okay? Uh, listen, don't forget what I told you, okay? Okay, Mom. Uh, uh, Abigail! Hi. Have a nice lesson. All right, thank you. Babe, he's calling again. Still not interested. Won't you even ask me which of them? Well, whoever it is, I am still not interested. Okay, it's Felix. Abigail, listen, I have never seen anyone this consistent. Three months of a constant no from you and he keeps calling. Well, that is the reason why he should stop. Can I have my phone back, please? Okay. Maybe I should tell you something. What? Johnson and I have been talking. <laughs> well, I know that. What? Okay. It was me who told him about you two months ago before Leah and I broke up. Look, I even told him where to find you. He's a good guy. Felix is a good guy too. Oh, listen, I know, I know we've had our hearts broken before, but these men are not anything like the ones we've had. So why are we punishing ourselves? Susie, you don't understand. Look, I really don't see myself giving my 100% to any man again, be it Felix or Dave or whoever. Listen. One date at a time. If I could go on a date with Johnson, what stops you from going on a date with Felix? Oh, sweetheart, it doesn't work like that. Well, this time it would work that way. I know how many times you told me about getting over my heartbreak and the rest of it. Now I'm returning the favor. Listen to me. If you do not go in there, dress up and go have dinner with Felix, the next time he calls, I'm inviting him over. Period. <laughs> you wouldn't dare. Okay. Watch me while I do it. <laughs> Abigail. Hi, Felix. You're welcome, please. Thank you. Have your seat. Ooh. Okay. I hope uh, Susie didn't put you up for this. Why would you ask me that? Uh, okay. Sorry about that. Would you want something? No, for now. Are you sure? Yes. Okay, let me start by first of all apologizing for lying to you three months ago. I am not married, but I know you know that now. Yes, and I know a lot of other things about you. But I must ask, why did you lie? You see, whoever the guy is that hurt you, I discover he has made it so difficult for single guys like us i mean to get close to you i saw the way you looked at me that day and uh, i knew i needed to buy some minutes so i had to say something what do you want abigail i lost my mom and my fiance the same day the next girl I dated slept with my uncle. Well, I'm sorry to hear that, but why are you telling me all of this? When I was hurting, people thought all I needed was to get another woman in my life. No. All I wanted was a friend. Don't date me. Just... Just let me be your friend. Hey. 
baby. I'm so sorry, I need to get my laptop. Yeah. Are you seriously going to leave? Yeah, I have a presentation uh, tomorrow morning. I don't understand. Understand what? You hardly make out time for me. What do you mean? I was here yesterday. After two weeks, Scarlett. After two weeks. Chase you up and down. I keep running after you to get your attention. But what is it? You don't even create time for us to enjoy special moments. Jeez, Leo. I'm trying here. Yeah. I mean, I, I was traveling these two weeks you're talking about. And besides, we don't need to choke each other. So, because he hurt her, something happens to him in the future that eventually makes him come begging her. Uh, you see, that's a part of the story that is not always true. Okay. I mean, the fact that someone left someone doesn't mean the both of them are not going to find happiness in their lives. And wishing that something bad happens to someone who hurts you is a trick that gets you stuck. Okay. Yeah. I really like our friendship though. <laughs> yeah, me too. Me too. Uh, I've always wanted this for myself. Thank you. Uh, let me go drop you because I, I need to rush and uh, see my dad. Oh, sure. Yeah. He called me earlier on, so let me go see what the old man has to say. <laughs> <laughs> Man, finally, you. Yeah, well. I think I'd be like you now. <laughs> <laughs> man, it's time for me to take this, my girl, serious one. Mm -hmm. And um, getting the new house will just do it for me. Yeah. You know, Scarlett, since she moved her things out, I've been able to get in touch with her. Have you tried calling her? Of course, several times. But I mean, who breaks up just like that? Without saying anything. You should have had the decency to say something to me, to my face. Look, man, it will be okay, okay? Just calm down, not to think of. Just give her space to sort herself and whatever it is that is plaguing her. Hmm? Meanwhile, I gotta go. Uh, wait, okay. I yeah. help you, make just be say I did nice to you, you know. You nice. Oh, I've always <laughs> been nice to uh, you now. Don't go hype yourself, guy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm coming. Oh, hi. hi. <laughs> Come in, please. Thank you. You have a seat. Okay, thank you. Well, um, I hope you're hungry because I'm cooking. Oh, I am hungry. Okay, that's good. Just give me some five minutes, okay? Oh. Um, by the way, how was the meeting with your dad? Oh, it went well. <laughs> Why are you smiling? He asked if I'm seeing someone, uh, and I, I said yes. Wait, since when did you start seeing somebody and you didn't say? Since when I told my dad, I think. Only that I've not asked her out because I wanted to be sure that we are there. Abigail, would you be my... Yes. Yes. Look, Felix, I just want to say thank you. I want to say thank you for being there and being patient with me. It was really important for me that I healed and you were there all through, even though I did not know how to. And you were there. 
and you show the true meaning of friendship. Thank you. Abigail, you are incredible. I mean, and, and so easy to love. Thank you so much. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> Just sit down, okay? Let me check on my foot. Okay. Just sit tight. <laughs> Send me away. 